Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Skyrim Special Edition Survival. Alrighty, when we left off, we had just entered the Halls of the Companions, and, and now we're going to try to join the Companions, and then talk to Bikai right after that, because he seems interesting. A Khajiit in the middle of the companion's halls while also apparently just doing custodial duties. There seems to be something going on there, especially since he seemed distracted when we talked to him. So we'll find out. Anyway, uh, we're going to talk to Cadillac now. A stranger comes to our hall. Yes. I would like to join the companions. Would you now? Yes. Here. Let me have a look at you. Mm. Yes, perhaps. A certain strength of spirit. Oh. Master, you're not truly considering accepting him. I am nobody's master, Vilkas. And last I checked, we had some empty beds in Yorvaskar for those with a fire burning in their hearts. Mm -hmm. Apologies. But perhaps this isn't the time. I've never even heard of this outsider. Sometimes the famous come to us. Uh. Sometimes men and women come to us to seek their fame. True. It makes no difference. What matters is their heart. And their arm. Hmm. Of course. How are you in battle, boy? I can handle myself. That may be so. This is Vilkas. He will test your arm. Okay. Vilkas, take him out to the yard and see what he can do. I. Okay. Well, there he goes. Uh, we'll go to the yard to train with Vilkis, but first things first. Vilkis will see if you're worth our trouble. Oh, okay. Our old Lydia, I forgot you were with me. Hi there. Uh, Bikai. Greetings. Is something the matter? Khajiit has lost his golden locket. Very important to him. You will help him look for it, perhaps. Mm -hmm. The last place this one headed was when he left it by his bed last night. Perhaps he's shivering in these cold Skyrim nights knocked it to the floor. Fair enough. I mean, you weren't able to look yourself? Uh, okay. I, I can take a look for you. You tell me where you slept. Bikai cannot thank you enough. This one's bed is in the big room with the eight beds. You will find okay. it by turning right inside and walking to the end. Yeah, that one. Okay. Yeah, I know. I know which one you're talking about. Where his locket would be located. Well, I don't see anything except a note on the floor. Crumpled note. She's ours now. If you want her back, it'll cost you. Kravanger Cave. We're waiting. There's some notes scrawled hastily on the back of the paper. Skyrim, Whiterun, Jorvaskar, Cat. Well... I think that uh, means that it was possibly intentionally taken. Although how they managed to get in here is a surprise. But... Hey! Yes? I didn't find your locket, but I did find a note. Khajiit understands. Stolen. Kranvangar Cave. Bikai saw this cave when he first came to Skyrim. East of Whiteran City, yes. Full of spiders. This one would go and investigate for himself, but as you can see, Khajiit is not equipped for such a journey. Yeah, you Giant definitely are not. Giant spiders also frighten Bikai. Oh. Perhaps you will go in Bikai's place? Find the locket, yes? Bikai would owe you a great debt. Sure, yeah, I'll, I'll check it. You bring this one great relief. Khajiit will await your return. Okay, sounds good. So uh, I guess I'll have to go to Kravanger Cave to resolve that for Bikai here. And he's afraid of spiders, not unlike uh, someone else later on. Hmm. Interesting. All right. Well, I guess if I have to go out to the yard with Vilkis. Wow, all the plates are on the floor. 
cooked. <laughs> Literally all the plates are on the floor, as is all the food. Okay. I should probably not be doing that. I should probably be holding swords right now. Hello. I'm here. The old man said to have a look at you. Yes. So, let's do this. Okay. Just have a few swings at me so I can see your form. Don't worry. I can take it. If you say so. Somebody help. Not that. Next time won't be so easy. Oh, yeah? You might just make it. But for now, you're still a whelp to us, new blood. So you do what we tell you. All right. Here's my sword. Go take it up to Yorland to have it sharpened. And be careful. It's probably worth more than you are. I don't know about that one, but okay. If you say so. Let's give the sword to Yorland. Who should be up here? Ooh, I'm hungry and I'm tired. Oh boy. Well, I can deal with the food problem easily enough. Just a quick salmon steak and I'm good. What brings you here? Well, uh, I had a sword to bring to you. Uh, I'm going to adjust my foot real quick. I'm guessing you're the newcomer then. Yeah. Does Aaron... <laughs> Does errands? Does Vilkis always send a newcomers on errands? Oh, don't worry too much about it. They were all whelps once. They just might not like to talk about it. Probably. Yeah. Don't always just do what you're told. Nobody rules anybody in the companions. That's fair. Someone has to be in charge, though. Well, I'm not sure how they've managed it, but they have. No leader since Yskrimor. Hmm. Kodlak is the harbinger. And he's a sort of advisor for the whole group. But every man is his own. Every woman, her own. Interesting. Are you a companion? Not actually a companion myself. But none of them know how to work a forge properly. And I'm honored to serve them. My name is Eorlin Greymane. I work the Skyforge. Best steel in all of Skyrim. All of Tamriel. Hmm. I'll need to get going. I have a favor to ask. Okay, what is it? I've been working on a shield for Aela. My wife is in mourning, and I need to get back to her soon. I'd be much obliged if you could take this to Aela for me. Much obliged, you say? Yeah, I can lend a hand. That's a good man. Thank you. I am a good man. Well, good Khajiit. Same thing. Oh, just noticed some uh, blue flowers that passed by. There we go. Always good to have more blue mountain flowers. They are good health potion material. These are good magic potion materials. Stamina is kind of... You don't really need it that badly. It's nice to have in a pinch, but it's not necessary. Not as necessary, I should say. Alright. Ayella was passing by us and going over here. So I assume she's down here somewhere. Uh, ah, here. Hello. If you wish to hunt with me, your feet need to be quick and your eyes quicker. Fair enough. I have your shield. Ah, good. I've been waiting for this. Good to see you made it up here. I did. Oh, this one. I saw him training in the yard with Vilkis. Yes. Ah, yes. I heard you gave him quite a thrashing. Don't let Vilkis catch you saying that. <laughs> Do you think you could handle Vilkis in a real fight? I don't care for boasting. Ah, a man of action. Yes. Here, let's have Farkas show you where you'll be resting your head. All right. Farkas. Did you call me? Of course we did, Ice Brain. <laughs> Show this Ice new blood brain. where the rest of the whelps sleep. New blood? Oh, I remember you. Yeah. Come on, follow me. Yeah, we'll do. Skior and Ayala like to tease me, but they're good people. Yeah. They challenge us to be our best. Mm. Nice to have a new face around. It gets boring here sometimes. Does it? I hope we keep you. This can be a rough life. The quarters are up here. Just pick a bed and fall in it when you're tired. Tilma will keep the place clean. She always has. Okay. 
All right, so here you are. Looks like the others are eager to meet you. Fair enough. Come to me or Ayala if you're looking for work. Once you've made a bit of a name for yourself, Skior and Vilkas might have things for you to do. Hmm. Good luck. Welcome to the Companions. All right. By the way, hmm. if you're looking for something to do, okay. we've gotten a letter about someone needing some muscle right here in Whiterun Hold. Okay. I don't know what the fight is about, and that's not our business anyway. Okay. I just need you to go out there, look tough, and scare this milk drinker into submission. Okay. No more than that. I don't want to hear about a killing, understand? Okay. Fair enough. No killing. Just beat them the fuck up if I have to. Gotcha. I can handle that. Go. Bring honor to yourself and the companions. Alrighty. Hired muscle. Who am I beating up? Come on. Come on. Why am I beating up a woman? Come on. And she's nice too. Why? Why? Oh man, I was hoping it was like Nazim or something. Because he's a prick. But you sold it. Come on. All oh, right. Okay. Jesus. All right. This sucks. I didn't want to do this. Uh, but now it's the mission I'm doing. <laughs> oh, come on. This is fucked, man. Oh, man. Tell me you're going by your home. That way I don't have to do this in front of people. Okay. <laughs> Alright. I think her house is like back here or something, isn't it? No, oh, that's Olava the Feebles. Okay. Oh, I'm noticing blue flowers though. So I should pick these up while I'm doing this. Oh, her house is back here. Okay. I think that's blue. Yeah, that's blue. Okay, cool. It's hard to tell in this light. Alright. Uh... This is close. Oh no. <laughs> Kids, go away. I'm going to buy the bannered mare from Hulda. Kids, go away, please. You don't want to see this. I don't even want to be a part of this. Oh man. I've been sent to resolve a dispute. You can't scare me into submission. Let's go. I don't want Come to. On. Can Let's I not? Oh <laughs> great. Everyone had to come over and watch. Come on, it's fine. It's fine, guard. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. You're tougher than you look. You got me, fair and square. I did, but I didn't want to. You know what you have to do. Fine. I'll take care of it. Just please leave me alone. I will. I didn't want to. I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't want to at all. Oh, God. At least the kids didn't have to watch. Oh, oh, come on. Hey, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I spend a lot Didn't of time at the to. market stall so I can learn the merchant's trade. I need more experience Oop, if I'm going to run an bit, inn someday. Itch my neck. You're looking to become a merchant? Before my ma and da passed, I told oh, them that God, one I'd day be I'd become oh, the best trader in Skyrim. I met one of the caravan leaders, Madron. He said he'd help me get started if I could bring him a mammoth's tusk. Easier said than done. I mean... Considering I just got done beating you up for a thing that I don't even know about, I can help you with that. You do that? If you find one, I could teach you a thing or two about trading. Help you get a fair bargain in the future? I mean, you don't have to. I did just kind of beat you down a little bit, but all Farewell. right. Farewell. <laughs> Thank you for giving me something I can do to make it up to you. <laughs> Come on, man. Oh, that's beyond fucked, man. <laughs> Come on. I didn't want to beat her up. I was hoping it was Nazim. Nazim's a jackass. A simpering bitch of a jackass. I shouldn't be swearing this early into an episode. <laughs> no, it's fine. It's like 15 minutes in. It's fine. It's fine. It's all fine. Fine. God. <laughs> I 
I mean, beating up your soldier was not fine, but I mean, where are you going? Where are you going, Skewer? <sighs> Fuck it. Ooh, red flowers. More red flowers. Hey. Getting all the flowers. Getting all the ingredients. Hell yeah. Alright. <sighs> I'm tired. Oh, I can grab these now. Nice. Nice. How about that? Nope. <laughs> Not at all. Not allowed. Fair enough. Not that either. I can't take the cabbage. And the ale. Ooh, nice. Always like ale. Well, I mean... Not in real life. Oh, sneeze. Coming up. Oh, jeez. Damn, that was a big sneeze. Alright. Okay. Um... <laughs> kind of blew those thoughts out of my brain. Alright, uh... I can continue kind of... Rooting around for good stuff. Ooh, horker meat. Hello. But I still enjoy the heft of a good hammer. Big swords should always beat little swords. Brave hearts beat lesser ones. That's the decider. Hmm. Glad I was able to catch that. Usually you don't hear a lot of interesting stuff that they talk about. Um, the sack I already emptied. There's other green apples. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. It's all fine. But this cupboard. Oh, I got gold in there. Nice. Up at this sack. Got some tomatoes. That's good. Not what I need, but it's good. Oh, some gloves. It's in this cupboard. Some more gold. Oh, some more ale. I'll take it. I'm mainly taking it because there's things that I can make with it. It's always very nice. Oh, can't steal from these end tables. Nor these. Fair enough. Uh, okay. Oh, it's green apples, but that's it. Okay. No, that's fine. That's fine. Perfectly fine. I should, however, sleep. But at the same time, I'm a little hurt. So, yeah. heal up and go to bed for about nine hours. Why not? Ooh. My nose is still a little stuffed after, uh, even after that sneeze. Give me a second. I'm going to try and clear that up. Okay, well, nose is cleared up now. Now I can actually breathe. Nice, okay. All right, let's talk to Farkas now that I'm awake. Hello, Farkas. Skewer says that I have the strength of Ysgrimor, and my brother has his smarts. Well, I mean, hey. At least uh, it was split ev evenly between you. Eh, okay. Anyway, I took care of the problem for Whiterun. You seem to have a knack for this kind of thing. I'll make sure people in charge know. I appreciate it. I'm looking for work. Skior was looking for you earlier. What does he want? Don't know. He just said he needed to talk to you before you do anything else. I don't like making him angry, but there is some work for you if you want it. <laughs> okay. Speak to Skior. Wasn't he going this way? Yes, he was. And he's sleeping. Well, I guess I kind of can't do that. <laughs> At least not yet. 
Uh, I'll take potatoes. Oh, I can take this coin first. Ooh, a bunch of ale. Oh, yeah. I'll take that. And that. That's good. Let's leave some for the rest of them. Yeah, but I'll take what I want. There's no reason why not. Right, and the tankard. Ooh. I can melt this down. And this down. It's not like anyone's going to use these. Up this down too. All right. Now I'm just going to be looting the place now that I'm considered a member of the companions. Hello. Well, that does that thing for you, Zelda, for me. It's basically outright. Didn't mean to take the basket, but it's fine. I'll take the bread and the carrot. Okay. Well, now I got to go through this. Try to put this basket back. Put this back where I... Yeah, there it is. Good enough. It's a Nord Mead. Okay. Fair enough. That's also Nord Mead. Some more wolf pelts. That's fine by me. It's red apple. No. Potato. Okay. Hmm. Can't reach over the bar to grab what's on the table. Ooh, ale. I'll take that. Here. Nord Mead. Okay. Mm. Potato. Some venison. One of those. Well, that fucked with the uh, balance of the plate a little bit. There we go. That makes it better. Ooh, a salmon steak. I'll take that. Uh, oh, there's a tomato on the floor. I'll take that, I guess. <laughs> Why not? Coin purse for me. Okay. For me? Yes, for me. Okay, I'll take that, that, and that. And I'll take this, okay. I'm just looting the place. <laughs> That's all I'm doing, really. Just looting the place. While I'm waiting for the rest of them to wake up, it's like six right now. Jesus. All I'm doing. Jesus. Alright. Take the cabbage. Right here. Red apples. Ah, I don't need red apples. At least not that badly. Alright, time to cook, I guess. It's about the time to do it. Especially since I have so many supplies to do it with now. Make beef stew, which is always pretty good. Restores a lot of stamina, but not much else. Hmm. Eh, well. Or. Yeah, there's horker stew. Restores a little stamina, but a lot of health. Mm, okay. Do that. Um. Hmm. Nah, nah, nah. I'll put that off for a little while. Venison. Go. Then the vegetable. Oh, I'm out of tomatoes. Ah, shit. Oh, fuck. I'm out of tomatoes. How the fuck did I get out of tomatoes? How the fuck did I get out of tomatoes? Oh, well. Um, hmm. It's kind of morning. A little bit. Green apple. Bread. Cheese. Just so I'm taking them off the floor. And then put this here. Oops. Put you over here. There it goes. <laughs> They're all on the floor. Fucking... Oh, it would take me forever just to fix everything. Fuck it. Fuck it, I'll leave it. I'll leave it alone. That's someone else's problem to fix. What? I didn't... Alright. 
didn't want to do this. Technically, all I wanted to do was grab the flowers, but... There we go. Since I'm here... One more. And I'm at six. Perfect. Now, I thought there was flowers there. Okay. What time is it? Ah, oh, it's like seven. People should be awake by now, but... Real quick, I'm gonna... See if I have the leather to make it. I... Don't. I do not have the leather to make it. Camping supplies is what I'm going to be investing my stuff into, but there's no leather rack here. Damn it! Damn it, Jorlin. Put a leather rack up there. God damn it. It'd be so much more useful to me. Specifically me. Okay. I wonder if I run into Yusuldo <laughs> while I'm in the market. And I'm hungry. Hangry. Grr. Uh, eat that. I feel better, but still package. Well, I mean. Eat that and that. And then have soup. There we go. Much better. Much, much better. And I shall use the leather tanning rack here. There we go. There we go. Alright. That takes care of that, and then I can make the camping supplies here. Whoops, that was not what I wanted to do. Aha! Build a campsite when outdoors. This will be very useful in the future. For right now, it shall just sit in my inventory. It'll be useful in the future because at a certain point, I'll desperately need things like uh, sleep and whatnot. And I won't be able to get it in any conventional means. So I'll have to make my own campsite. Sold Once I've made enough money trading with the Khajiit caravans, I'm going to buy the Bannered Mare from Hulda. Fair enough. Well, here's a mammoth tusk to get you started on that. Thank you. This should turn that old cat's gaze. Maybe I'll be able to become a caravaneer myself one day. There you go. As promised, let me show you a thing or two about bargaining. <laughs> Don't want some shifty merchant giving you a raw trade. Very true. I do appreciate Farewell. it. Farewell. Farewell. Thank you. I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna take these. I'm gonna take these. Wow. A lot of these. Okay. I didn't think there'd be so many of them. Jeez. But then again, it is a special edition. They did add a lot more of these sort of little nodes to the world. It does help. Ooh. I'll take that too. Alright. Time to head up back to your Vasker, because all of them should be awake enough. I can talk to them. Pardon me. Awake, but probably not eating. At least not yet. Uh, just to make it easier to find him. Yeah, he's still down here. Okay, cool. Alright. And he's still in his bed? No, oh, he's in his room, just not in his bed. There you are. Yeah, you wanted to see me? I did. Your time, it seems, has come. What do you mean? Last week, a scholar came to us. He said he knew where we could find another fragment of Wuthrad. Mm -hmm. He seemed a fool to me. But if he's right, the honor of the Companions demand that we seek it out. Okay. What does this have to do with me? This is a simple errand. Mm -hmm. The time is right for it to be your trial. Oh. Carry yourself with honor, and you'll become a true Companion. Okay. Varkis will be your shield sibling on this venture, Welp. Okay. He'll answer any questions you have. Try not to disappoint. 
or to get him killed. I could try. I mean, try not to get him killed. You know. Trying not to disappoint will be a difference. <laughs> Skyrim, may your bugs never change. <laughs> I hope you've readied yourself. <laughs> I'm about as ready as you are. <laughs> you gonna be my shield brother on this? So I'm told. Let's see if you impress. All right. Sounds okay. What? Okay, that shouldn't have happened, but all right. All right then. <laughs> To sit on the bench. I meant to talk to him, but considering he was basically one with the bench, we should keep moving. All right. Uh, I'll meet you at Dustman's Cairn. Don't delay, Shield Brother. Okay. Good. 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 All right. Um, that's still still. All right. Had to double check. All righty. Away I go. How much food do I have? It strikes me that she has all of my metal. You're going to lose horribly and then say you let me win? Probably. Then you're on. <laughs> Guess they're uh, gonna play a game. <laughs> Alright. Well, here we are, and here we go. Following, uh,. Farkas, on our way to Dustman's Cairn. That was weird. Don't think I hit the button twice. Uh, Emran's sword is there. 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 That's my inventory, anyway. 460. Okay. Well, she can hold on to my metal for a while. I'll just take it from her later on. Shouldn't be too hard. All right, well, onward we go towards an adventure. But first, go to Arcadius Cauldron. Arcadius Cauldron. Give a holler if you have any questions. Will do. Right now I just want to use your alchemy lab for that. But keep trying new things. Of course. rewards inquisitive minds. Well, yeah, of course it does. Ooh. Blew through all of that. Aha. So... If there's anything I can help you with, you have but to ask. Well, of course. Keep that in mind. Huh. I don't have anything in particular that I wanted to do. I sell cures for all ills, and I'll be happy to serve you. Tundra cotton and lavender. There's that. It's not a lot, but it's something. At least unlocks that part. Uh, oh, you have a death bell. Okay. You look rather pale. Well, yeah. Ah, so you're an alchemist then. That I am. That I am. Looks like you have a couple... You don't... They're, they're not for sale. You have them out, but they're not for sale. Are you for real? That's mean. Okay, well, I have that at least. Uh, some store healths, which I desperately needed after that fight. Um, hmm. Hmm. I'm not selling you that for five gold. Fuck you. You're out of your mind. Um... I sell eight, eight of those, though. I don't see why not. Um, a lot of these you don't you don't pay a lot for. <sighs> That's unfortunate. It is very unfortunate. Hmm. Interesting that I have so many that are so low value. I'll just sell you those, because I don't really need them that badly. 
Um. Hmm. I can barely sell Come you anything. Back anytime if you need a remedy. Yeah, we'll do. Will do. All right. Well, I desperately need health potions, but I don't think I'm going to be able to get that. I ain't asking. We've got to sell as much as we can as soon as we can. That's what you always say. Because it's always true. Can we at least go to the tavern for supper? Oh, and a thing, I was going to feed you cabbages and apples again. Yes, little fairy, we can go to the tavern for supper. Yes! <laughs> it's kind of adorable. Uh, I should probably buy health potions if she has them available. I probably Pardon me, should. But do I detect a case of the rattles? No. I've got something for that. I don't have it, but, uh... Nice try. <laughs> what have you got Take for some look? Uh, potions, minor healing, not much else. It's all you got is just one. Ah, uh, come on. You do have a lot of blister wart, though, but you're selling it for a hell of a lot. Jesus. All right, then. Um, I have several elixirs for sale. Do you ever think of returning to Cyrodiil? Why? Because I'm a proud citizen of the Empire? Um... Because the Stormcloaks only want Nords in Skyrim? Um... The Stormcloaks can rot in oblivion for all I care. I've lived in this city for 20 years. 20! I wasn't meaning like that. But... Sorry? <laughs> You're a healer? Of a sort. I don't have formal training in the Restoration School, mm. but... Something just as good. Oh, yeah? Within these walls, I have all that I need to brew a potion for nearly any ailment. If I had a septum for every case of rock joint or wit bane I've cured since I opened this shop, I'd be a rich woman indeed. Hmm. Interesting to learn. Okay. Come back anytime if you need a remedy. Fair enough. Fair enough. I'd be perfectly fine using your ingredients, but you seem to want to sell them for an exorbitantly high amount. So, I mean... <laughs> Alright. So, onward we go. Oh, I have a level up. I didn't know that I did. Well, shit. Well, time to go sleep in a bed, I guess. God damn it. Already. Oh, of course, Nazim's going to be a jackass to Isolde, because that's what Nazim does best, is be a jackass. I'm going to go sleep for a little while. Where am I at, anyway, in that regard? I have to go all the way to active effects to find out. Fatigue is refreshed, so nearly t drained I'm not hungry and picking pockets uh, blah, blah, blah. I'm warm okay so I'm warm that's fine and I just need to go to sleep and then eat something and then I should be good just get a little bit of sleep good like five hours health good um where should i put this good question that i can't answer currently um probably a good place and then i have a second that i can put here there we go that'll keep me alive for a little while longer now i'm hunky uh Eat the salmon steak. There we go. Alright. And then we head out and do the thing with Arcus. 
Sounds like a plan to me. That's for damn sure. Okay. Alrighty. What's my money looking like right now? 3,469. I felt like I had more. Didn't I have more at the start of this episode? Hmm. Interesting. Alright, well... Maybe I did, maybe I didn't. Maybe I'm just losing my mind. But I could have sworn I did. Ah, well. Onward we go. To complete missions and things. Oh! Khajiit Caravan. What do I got that I could sell? I mean, a, a decent amount, but... Huh. Interesting. I got that. I could sell that. It'd probably be best to run these for a little while. I forgot to smelt these down. I'm an idiot. And I might be able to upgrade these a little bit. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go back into White Run because I'm stupid. And uh, deal with <laughs> the smelting of the stuff and then upgrade my equipment. Or at least the equipment I have on currently. As much of it as I can. Upgrading the leather might be a little bit more difficult. Because I don't really have a lot of it. But my swords and my bow I could easily do. Have you met my father? He's a I have, up at Dragon's Reach. but I, I kind of I kind of need the smelter, Adrian. I'm sorry. You're just going to be in my way the whole time, aren't you? Uh, yeah, I'll smelt down the iron arrows. I don't need them in that battle. Axe and Warhammer. There we go. Thank you. I help my father in more ways than people read. Okay. Rhinestone. Ow. I thought I was running a different bow. <laughs> I guess I'm not. I could fix that. I could run the Imperial bow. Absolutely no problem. I could make that. And then upgrade it. Absolutely no problem at all. Yeah. 16. That ain't too bad. 16, ain't too bad. 14, ain't too bad. I could just sell the old stuff that I don't need. But I'll sell that to the Khajiit. Oh, I see. You're trying to show how many connections you actually got in this city. Okay. Alright. I see. I see what you're putting down. I'm picking up what you're putting down. I get it. I see. See what you're on about. I would just rather sell to the Khajiit because, well, might as well converse with my own people from time to time. Right? Khajiit welcomes you. And also your coin. I'm sure you do, my friend. What if you had for Take sale? Take a look. Well, you don't have too much gold, but you do have a lot of good stuff. A lot of good stuff. Jesus. Cork bulb root. Fungus stalk. Moon sugar. Scalen fin. I don't know what that does, but that looks interesting. Uh, you do have some more healing potions than, uh, well, at least stronger healing potions than what they did back in town. There's that at least. Um, hmm. I'm not selling that, no. I'm selling this. And that. Mm, not selling those. Not 
selling those. But I could sell you some of these things. Yeah, some of these things I've picked up. Not that. But this. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. I could sell you all that and not care too much about it. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, May your road lead you to warm sands. Thank you. Okay. And we move on. Oops. It helps if I move on in a direction that I can actually walk in. And we shall move on towards... The... Dustman's Cairn location. Ooh. I forgot. I haven't favorited the bow that I just made for myself yet. But... I wonder how much better will it help me in hunting. Can't be terrible, right? Oh, come on. Helps if I actually make the shot. Wait a minute. Did it actually kill it? Did it actually kill it? <laughs> it actually killed it. Killed it in one shot. I'll be damned. <laughs> I thought I needed to make another shot. <laughs> All right. Okay. All right, let's see if I can try and recover the arrow from the one that, that got away. No. Doesn't seem like I can find it. Damn it. Okay, well. Onward we go. Towards Dustman's Cairn. Oh, 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 wait. Well, since it seems to be possible I can kill them in one shot... Time to do proper hunting. <laughs> All right. Okay. <laughs> oh, leather is going to be so much easier to get now. I didn't expect it to be holding on to gold, but here we are. Oh, man. Oh, hunting's going to be so much easier. How much arrow? I don't have that many arrows left. I have maybe, like, less than 40. Yeah, 38, yeah. <laughs> I saw a number, and then my brain didn't really take it in until I looked at it again. But, yeah, I have a decent number, just not enough to be going crazy with. Oh boy. I think this location has a dead saber cat in it. I'm gonna try and grab it. And then it also has a couple of things that would be useful for me. Uh, just base by themselves. Grab these as well, for sure. Uh trying to be sneaky about it. Oh. He noticed me. He's not happy I'm here. Uh, these are the things I was talking about. These would be useful. Okay. Um, I'm going to try to get this. I think I found... Hey, there's a sweet spot. Necklace of Resist Magic. That ain't too bad. Iron Battle Axe, that ain't too bad. Oops. Yeah, sorry, just taking stuff. Sorry. Taking stuff that was worth it to me. Bye. <laughs> Alright. Wasn't too bad. But my other necklaces... I don't have another necklace. What? What was I thinking I had a necklace? 
Well, I mean, hey, resist magic. I'll take it. Oh, geez. Oh, geez. Oh, boy. Oh, geez. Oh, geez. Oh, gosh. Oh, geez. Oh, geez. Oh, gosh. Uh, we'll go to Sparks and... Oh, you <laughs> he died standing up. There you go. Now you're down. I was hoping not to get diseased, but it's fine. It's fine. Because now I have ingredients that will help me, well, think. Do I have the mud crab chitin still? I do. <laughs> now I have a very potent cure disease potion that I can basically use at any time. Ah, fuck. You bastard. Alright. I'm not letting you run away if I can help it. And you're not going to run away anyway from the look of it. And... What? What? It didn't kill you? That's weird. Now it did. <laughs> Alright, well. Took two, but I got gotcha. you. You got a casserade on you? Okay, that's weird. Anyway. Closer we get to Desmond's Cairn, the more I should be paying attention to my surroundings. Why are you running? Oh, you're no longer running. Oh, now you are. Okay, um... If you're just running... I mean, hey, it was an easier option. There we go. Especially since they were just going to meander anyway, and I was pretty sure I wasn't going to get the, uh... The, uh, stealth bonus damage. Okay, and... If I just do this. There we go. Got one. I don't think I'll get the other. Honestly, do not think I'll be able to get the other. Call it good with this. El Kaid. Oh, and I got my arrow back. Nice. Beautiful. You s <clears throat> they all blend into the background. I can never tell them that they're there. Alright. Oh, that was a fox. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. I don't need to hunt that down. Foxes ain't worth it. Alright, but there's a little side thing that we're, we're going to do before Dustman's Cairn. Right over there. The spot right next to it. But, uh... Didn't think that fox would be there. But we're going to do that in the next episode. I just want to make sure I'm positioned enough to do the thing. Alright. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Son of a bitch. <laughs> well, they had to spot me just before I did the thing. But, I'll deal with that in the next episode. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and only Stray Cat. Playing games and trying to get us further down the companion storyline. While also making sure we're upgraded enough to survive it. That's going to be the trick that I'm not sure we're going to be able to do. But we're going to try for you.